Right, so a well overdue update. Uh, we um, on Saturday we went up to the uh, waterfall with Klaus, which was really nice. Um, a bit like Harry Mary Scary at some points because we went crossing over it because we we chose the rough route instead of the easy route. <laughs> but. Um, well, yeah, it was fun. It was good. Uh, he said it was half an hour's uh, walk. Uh, it turned into two hours. So it put a lot of time on our on our trip. But we're not that well bothered, really. That's what part of it. We've got another two weeks here, so... But, yeah, up to the uh, waterfall. Um, and then we... That was at Sh uh, where we were staying at Spella guest house which is really really nice John's really nice he's uh, doing loads of hard work on his on his guest house he's made a restaurant maybe link it into a video so uh, I don't know where we're at at the moment there's no signpost but we're on our way to uh, is it Chestnut Chestnut Hotel is it Chestnut Hotel Chestnut guest house maybe so we'll look it up it's uh, hold on I'm going to one hand this on the Rickety Road. Um, but yeah, this is coming up on the other mountains, snowing this time. Not as thick as Theth. Or oh, Chestnut Hill, it's called. Um, oh, sugar. I'm in, I'm in uh, control of the uh, sat nav here and it's going funny. There you go. Um, but yeah, not as bad as um, Theth, obviously. But probably more hairy than death in a sense of there's more stuff in the road. No! Okay. Looks like we're being beaten by the weather. So we're currently heading uh, north or north northeast on SH30 Cafe Cafe Benny or Quaff Benny. Anyway, that's a forest area, and as you can see, it's uh, snowing. So I've just pulled over into a patch. This is the first patch that we've found that's actually dried and shielded by these trees because we're on the side of this mountain. So, and we've made the decision to stop going north because it's more mountainous and we don't want to get to a point where we're coming down the mountain and then losing control of the vehicle because I think it's going to be bad enough going back the other way because we've been climbing, climbing, climbing. Um, I want to get back to some sort of sort of like civilization because looking at the road on Google Maps, um, there's out there, literally out there, it's just road. So it's a big no. So sadly, uh, we're gonna have to cancel the accommodation um, and go back down the other way, the way we came, back down to some um, warmth. I think it's about one degree up here in the north. Uh, so we're gonna get back down to like. Um, 15, 16 degrees safety. <laughs> but, you know, it's what it is. So, and it, obviously it doesn't help with being in an automatic either in this kind of thing. So, I, it's uh, luckily it's a semi-automatic, so I've just slapped it into manual, into like a, a medium gear. So, because if I leave it in automatic, we've just been wheel spinning up this hill and then the uh, skid control kicks in, which then drops the revs, but then you're losing, obviously, momentum and you don't want to get stuck. And I don't want to be trying to slide back down a, a mountain. Um, but yeah, good fun, really. Uh, good fun. So, yeah, onwards and downwards. Right, so we've just left, uh, we left the cafe, Venus Cafe. Uh, we booked it, we got what on Wi Fi, booked a hotel back near Tirana. On the, is it on the edge of Tirana? On the co well, it's near no. the coast. No. no, it's on the coast, it's uh, on the. It's north. Yeah, it's probably north. Like, it's my for Tirana, it's west. Yeah. But it's so we can. We've looked at the weather. Uh, Tirana is 17 degrees tomorrow, no clouds. So we're going back to Tirana to try and do the sky lift. Uh, but yeah, that Venus uh, cafe was really nice. Uh, we noticed that they always give you a glass of water yeah. over here with your coffee. 
Which I know you can request it in England, but it just seems to be the norm. Like they just do it. Bloody like they give you water with everything though, water with breakfast. Yeah, water nice. with every meal, they just give you a glass of water for free. No problem. But yeah, it's raining now instead of snowing, it's not sleety. Uh, they got in touch with us at the other place saying we'll give you a lift up to, like they got in touch with Lou on WhatsApp. Uh, they said oh, we'll give you a lift to the uh, hotel for another 30 euros and we're like no okay no we're not doing that <laughs> you can bog off because I bet it's 30 quid yeah. one way 30 quid the other yeah, way 30 like, euros. I'll send my brother yeah 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 like, in a 4x4 four four. I was like yeah. uh, no, sorry no. no but yeah so we're on our way back towards Tirana area but is, is it Milan? 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 Milo. Milo? no Milan. Mi yeah it ends in tea or something, doesn't it? So, yeah. But yeah, it's a nice ho hotel. Uh, it's on the beach from only 15 euros for one night. And you there's an extra 5 euros for breakfast. 20 euros for two people uh, on a beachfront apartment or a villa yeah. apartment. Um, so yeah, we'll do a video later on and uh, yeah, the show you what's going on. 